What's poppin? It's your boy. So for today's video, I'll show you how I modded and customized my Red Dragon Fizz. The first step is to remove the keycaps. Since I've already modded this board, I only need to remove the keycaps necessary to unscrew the plate from the board. The next step is to pry open the case. For this, you'll need a pry tool of some sort. For me, I used an old phone case to get it open. Now underneath the board, you can see the mods I installed such as the sound dampening mod and weight mod where I added lead weights to the case using super glue. The PCB also has masking tape behind it also known as the tempest mod or tape mod. Now onto the 3D printed case. This is a 660 3D printed case, a free file which is linked below. I edited the file to have a side USB port since that is what the Red Dragon Fizz has. I also pre-installed the stabilizer since you will not have access to the spacebar stabilizer after closing the case. The stabilizers are a mix of stock and other ones that are already modded. Always remember to install the cornermost switches first to avoid the PCB from moving around. Also, I have a short review video on this keyboard that talks about its strong points linked below. Feel free to check it out. Be careful when you install the switches since you can damage and scratch the PCB with the pins. After installing all the switches, you'll have something that looks like this. Note that there are no standoffs between the plate and PCB, which means that the switches are holding everything in place. Now onto the last part, which is assembling and putting together all of the components. I used 12 screws to hold everything in place. The initial print holes were too small for the screws I had on hand so I needed to dremel the holes to make them wider. I also added rubber feet to avoid the board from moving around. After that's done, we move to the last step which is adding the keycaps. In my case, I used a stock keycap set that came with the board, but you can use any cherry compatible keycap set. And there you go.
you go. A completed 660 build using a Red Dragon Fizz as the donor PCB. Enjoy the scuffed B-roll. I printed two cases for this build, one being orange and the other being translucent which I sticker bombed on the inside. The following video will be a sound test. And that's it. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. If you guys want a switch lubing tutorial, comment down below. Peace out.